The Highway Patrol says a man was hit and killed this morning in Greenville County. WYFF News 4's Allison Powell has more. A deadly hit and run caused traffic to stand still this morning for many on their way to work. Whitehorse Road was down to one lane heading north towards Traveler's Rest near Lily Street. Troopers say someone hit and killed a pedestrian a little after 5 a.m. They don't know much about the accident. Corporal Bill Ryan hopes you can help. Right now we have very little to go on. We're looking at um, evidence and stuff that we have at the scene at this point in time. Um, we are asking anybody who was driving in that area around 510 this morning, e even if they think they saw anything, please give us a call, give us some information, because it may be uh, information that we need to bring this to a close. The accident affected local businesses as well, shutting down this gas station for about three hours. The owner of this gas station said he didn't even have to make coffee this morning like he normally does because people couldn't even pull in here because of the crime tape that the highway patrol put up. The owner of Harry's Quick Stop says his surveillance footage does show the accident, but it's hard to see in the recording. Ryan hopes video like that can shed some clues on what happened and who is responsible. They'll canvas this area and they'll look at all the different businesses and see any businesses that have uh, potential surveillance footage and they'll look at that for that time frame to try and uh, locate what type of vehicle, or excuse me, identify what type of vehicle it was so we hope they'll be able to locate it. If you have any information on the accident, you can call Highway Patrol at 864 241 1000 and leave your name and number with a dispatcher. WIFF News 4, Allison Powell in Greenville County. And investigators are still working to identify the victim of this hit and run. They say he was a man in his 20s or even his late teens. They say he was wearing a white shirt, brown jacket, nylon blue shorts, purple and orange Nike socks, as well as tan colored Crocs. Tonight, we're getting a look at.